Jay Gray of Gray Fishing. So good to have you with us. Um, this is part of the $50 Tackle Box project. One of my guide clients asked me if I would put together a $50 tackle box of introductory bass fishing gear that they could use on strip pits and farm ponds in their area. Uh, like I said in the introductory video, we're assuming you're fishing with monofilament line, usually on spinning tackle. The first thing in the $50 tackle box was a cheap bag of one ot extra wide gap hooks. We used the Angler's Outdoors uh, generic version from Walmart. They're about a buck a bag. Um, they're not a super strong one ot wide gap hook, but it's perfect for introductory fishing. So, so here's your wide gap. All of the things we tie on um, in the $50 tackle box we'll use a Palomar knot for and so you can find a video on YouTube tying a Palomar knot but let me give you just a brief example you double the line over, you fold it in half and you put that folded over part through the eye of the hook like so then you make an overhand knot bring in the tag end through that loop goes through the circle that you made you put your lure or your hook or whatever you've got through that loop, okay? Looks like that. You need to get it a little wet because the friction will melt the line or burn the line and you pull it tight just like that. Then you either bite or take your cheap scissors and cut off that extra piece. And, boom, like that. There you go, a Palomar knot. So the Palomar knot will be used throughout the $50 tackle box. So we've spent a dollar so far on the bag of hooks. We spent six dollars or so on the plastic box itself. The next thing we're the next thing we're adding into the $50 tackle box is a bag of quick sinks. These are stick worms from quickbaits.com. They are um, sinking soft plastic stick worms. There are a lot of brands, but I like to use the quick baits version. <clears throat> Looks like this. This is the green pumpkin color. They're flappy on both ends. This is the first rig you need to learn. It's called the wacky rig. Okay? Take your stick worm, take your one ot extra wide gap hook. The worm, uh, this, the hook goes right through the center of the worm, just like that. See, it's an exposed hook. Like that, the, the worm sits on the hook just like this. This is the whole thing. This is a wacky rigged quick sink from Quick Baits. Fish this on the edge of weed lines, not in the weeds. This will get hooked in everything. If it's a weedy lake, don't throw this into the weeds, but on the edge of the weeds or around docks or dock pilings or any kind of structure, you can let this sink down onto rocky shore or rock piles in the middle of the lake. You'll catch a lot of fish with this. You'll feel the fish take it. It'll tap just a couple times and set the good set, make a good hook set, and you should catch your first fish. Wacky rigged, quick sink. The first thing in the $50 tackle box. Grayfishing.com, J Gray Fishing on Facebook. Quick J on Cyberdust and at J Grave on Twitter. Follow me and let's connect. If you have any questions, let me know. We'll see you real soon.